You don't realise, I think everybody in Netherton either lived in here or know oh, somebody who yeah. lived in yeah. here and have partied in there yeah. <laughs> at some yeah. point, you know. Just living there or oh my auntie lived in there or yeah, we I first did. moved yeah, in tried. there, you know. Yeah. That's right. I mean, yeah, I was, in, I was only here for seven and a half years, but it was my first, me and my husband's first home sort yeah. of thing together so it was like you know we moved in here the day we got married Did you? yeah mm. the day we got married 26 of september 1975 oh, oh. so that'd been up what about 10 years by then 1967 mm. eight years we were the last one to go yeah that's sort of force force we in the end wow uh, a force we in the end. But the flats was lovely. Yeah. I mean, the living rooms. But massive. Lovely size. I mean, that's bigger than my house that I'm in now. There was two bedrooms, good size. That was fantastic flats. I mean, when, I know, well, Steve would remember, because when we moved in, it was the old metal windows. Yeah. And that was horrible. You used to wake up in the morning in the winter and they'd be like streaming. That was vile, wasn't that? When they put the new windows in, it was like, oh, that's fantastic. Oh. Yeah. You know, it was alright. It was a bit rough years ago, but they sorted it out. Yeah. You know, yeah, well, the times that we was here, I mean, we was here from 89 to 96. Yeah. And to be honest, you know what? In them seven and a half years, I've never had a bit of trouble in these flats. No. Not ever. Never had any trouble whatsoever. And um, we never had any hassle off anybody. Nothing. It was like, you know, it was a nice period of time to be in yeah. there. Yeah. And the, the, the other thing about it is... It's 172 flats here. Yeah, so it's a right. whole estate. And you know, you never see nobody. I wouldn't move out of Netherton. No, no. That's just my idea, right? Yeah. And Netherton's a very hard place to get into. Yeah. Yeah. Be more right where we are, mate. It's just that uh, it takes a getting used to after 40 odd years. I know some people who, uh, some, well, it's my friend who lives in Wales, but it's her auntie and uncle. They lived in uh, Manor in Wales and they're getting on now and they've had to move out and they was devastated because yeah. they'd only ever known that flat. At the end of the day, I used to love it because you used to walk in these flats, you get in the lift, get off the lift, yeah. you go in your front door, That's it. everything was one more level, there were yeah. no stairs, there yeah. was nothing. You know, to be honest, once you'd moved it, once you'd walked into your flat, you could be 20, 20 stories high or on the ground floor, it was your space. That's right. You know what I mean? It didn't matter what was sort of outside. Yeah. You know, you, things that you get used to, like taking your rubbish out, putting it down the chute. Oh, no, when you... somebody's blocked the shoe up and he's yeah, like, yeah. rubbish I going yeah. down. <laughs> Things but... like that. But once you've shut your front door, it was like, yeah. well, yeah. you know. And there was lovely flats, yeah. lovely size. We we looked after, I mean, mum and she's going to pick the rubbish up every day mm. without fail. Yeah. I'd walk around these flats and I'd pick every bit of rubbish. There wouldn't be no rubbish of it. The road garage is on top. Another row of garages across there. Oh my lord. Yeah. There's all the cameras and everything. We was only blocks. We was only blocks of flats in Dudley. Mm. So our cameras on every landing. I know, it was only seven years of my life. But as I say, it was like me and my husband, he's our first home together. Um, and we had some great times here. As I said, I've never had any trouble at all while I was, while we was in here. Oh, you've never been I don't care what anybody says about it. I do. I love it. 